Animal Defense Academy. Number one, read the items carefully and choose the correct answer. You may look back at the selection to answer the questions. And remember, you can pause this video and restart it or keep move forward at any time. Number one, the following question has two parts. First answer part A, then answer part B. Part A, which defense system does a hagfish use? A, slime, B, armor, C, poison, D, stink. Part B, which sentence from the selection best supports your answer for part A? Like the pangolin, the armadillo is covered in hard, leathery plates. B, not only does the attacker get pierced, but also poisoned. C, another great defense is to make yourself smell really, really bad. D, the hagfish uses slime as its armor. Number two, which bird in this selection is probably the largest? A, fulmer bird. B, ostrich. C, hoopo. D, turkey vulture. Number three, even though prairie dogs hide, they are fast because they A, need big holes to hide their spines, B, are covered with armor, C, have to get into their holes quickly, D, dig a hole each time they hide. Four, what do you think a leaf insect looks like? A, a flower, B, a leaf, C, a stick, D, a rock. Number five, which phrase from the selection matches the word deception? A, appearances often are deceiving. B, the skunk shows no mercy. C, caterpillars put all their eggs in one basket. D, Honesty is not always the best policy. Six, match each animal on the left with its defense method on the right. I'm gonna read the left side first. Ostrich, snail, skunk, octopus, opossum. On the right, run, lie, hide, stink, armor. Read the items carefully. Use complete sentences to answer the questions. Number seven, what does the expression burn the midnight oil mean and where did it come from? Number eight, birds can fly. In which category of animal defense does this fit best? Explain your answer. Number nine, why do you think the broken wing strategy works? 10. Why do you think burrowing owls and prairie dogs live in the same habitat?